It was uh, September 1981, uh, Southern League Championship. We were playing for Orlando, I was part of the Orlando Twins team for Minnesota Twins organization. We were going to Nashville to play the championship round against the Nashville Sounds, which was the New York Yankee affiliate. Well, back in those days, we took these long bus rides, 16-hour bus ride to be exact. We played our first two games in Orlando, proceeded to go to Nashville in best three out of five. We were fortunate enough to come out and win the third game and the fourth game to clinch the championship three games to one. On that team that we played against was big league manager Buck Showalter, Otis Nixon, William McGee, a couple of major league players. On our team we had Tim Lodner, Gary Gaetti, Randy Bush, major leaguers like that. Well, Tom Kelly was our manager and everybody knows what kind of prestigious career he had as a manager. Well, it was really his first time through as a manager, so he figured after we clinched the championship, he'd give us an hour or two to celebrate. So he went to a local bar, and we all had a great time, and in a short period of time, you could celebrate a lot. And we ended up getting on the bus for the 16-hour ride back. Well, I guess Tom did not anticipate that some of us drank a little too much in a short period of time, and the next thing you know, 10 minutes into the bus ride, one guy loses it on the right side of the bus, and then I was in the back, and I have to fess up. I was one of them that lost in the back of the bus, and the best one of all, though, was Tim Tuffle, who's now the third base coach with the New York Mets in the big leagues. Timmy was our second baseman, and I guess he thought, I don't know if he thought or if he just wasn't thinking or whatever the case may be, but he thought the bus window was open when he lost it. And he realized that after the fact that the window was in fact closed and the window sprayed all over the bus. So basically for 16 hours it was the longest, raunchiest, stinkiest bus ride back. And the celebration was short lived because we got so sick to our stomachs the rest of the way home that we didn't even have time to enjoy it. But I guess that was all one claim to fame, and that's how we enjoyed our championship, coming home in 16 hours worth of crap and diarrhea and stuff like that. But heck, we got a ring afterwards, and it was a great time. That's a nice story to tell 30 years later. Thank you so much.